That's what we're going for. Trying to get the no hit every single time. Trying to make that 40,000 points back that I just spent. Oh, okay. No, I hear you. Oh, no, that was close. That's distracting. Alright, sounds like there's another one. Can't tell though. Get it! Just die. God, leave that one didn't want to die, dude. Got him. Get out of here, chump. Even if we don't get the combo, it's okay. It's okay if we don't get the combo, because as long as we kill five, we get the no get them. It's just better. It's just better if you do get the if you kill five. I hear you. Oh, he was trying that tricky yicky yicky. It didn't work. Get out of here, chump. Beat it, kid. Gotta kill them all. Gotta kill them all. I'm going to your house and I'm killing all your family members. Dinosaurs, okay? Don't take it out of context. I don't believe we can go back there. All right, so that beam right there is what we gotta destroy. And I believe we need the torpedo for it. So we gotta be careful. People didn't like this part at the time because they were like, ugh, it's so slow and it's so, ugh. I don't think it's that bad. I think it's pretty good. It is a change of pace, but. Uh oh. Oh! I mean, in my opinion, I always viewed you as being pretty much invincible during this. This is the only part in the game where they give you a gun that has unlimited ammo. It's weak, but... It's a gun with unlimited ammo nonetheless. Alright, get out of here, kid. Beat it. No hit bonus. Oh. oh! Can you recommend some games like Dino Crisis? The only games that are like Dino Crisis are Resident Evil. The old school Resident Evils. That's it. There's no other games really out there on the market that are like Dino Crisis at all. To be honest. This game's very unique. I mean, there's not too many games that actually put you up against dinosaurs like this and are, and are good. Most dinosaur games are actually surprisingly really bad. I mean, you could say Torok. I mean, Torok was a really popular game at the time that had dinosaurs in it, but I don't think the last Torok game did really well because there hasn't been one since. Um, I don't. I think the last Torok game came out in like 2008, I believe. It's a shutter to close the waterway. You can hear a low sound of the machines, but it doesn't seem like the machines are stopping. Yeah, the game, uh, this is like RE, because it's from the makers of RE. Um, the makers of RE made this made this series, so. And then Dino Crisis 3 is like so bad. Dino Crisis 3 is so bad. Ridiculously bad. It's not even worth playing. Let's get out of here. Can't come back here. I mean, for a story and stuff, uh, like time travel and stuff like that. I don't know too many Dino games. Not really. That are like are like this. Not really. Yeah, I really, I really don't know too many Dino games. The only, the only Dino games I know are like. Well, you got Dino Stalker, which is. 
It's a rail game. Silent Hill, sort of the silent first Silent Hill. I've never played Silent Hill. I promised I to play Silent Hill so long ago, and I still haven't done it. Get out here, kid. Beat it. Let me go this way. I would say Dino Crisis 3 has more more stuff in common with Resident Evil 3, and Dino Crisis 1 has more stuff in common with RE1 and 2. I think there's another one in here. I, can't I mean, no, I mean a game with this kind of movie like you know what I mean um not really to be honest not really it's kind of a hard question this section of the column has a crack making it weak I know with a weapon with a little firepower you'd probably be able to break it and destroy it I know but you didn't have to tell me why a dinosaur is in my face man I think you literally have to buy the weapon just to do that. I believe so. I don't think there's any other way out of it. I'm not sure if you can break it with the needle gun. What does this say? The wall of this terminal which offers a uh, instinctive point service. The keyboard is gone. It could be like a swimming reptile destroyed it. Ha! <laughs> That's cool. Those things we save our game at, that was one of them. That's cool. No hit bonus. Sweet. Uh, movie like? No, that's kind of hard. Because, uh, I think that's up to everybody else's different interpretation of a game, to be honest. So, I, it's kind of hard. I can't really tell you what games are movie like ish, really. Because, uh, your opinion of what a game that's movie like ish might be different from mine. But, in all and honestly, I don't really know what to recommend under that kind of question anyway, to be absolutely honest. I have no idea what to recommend. I didn't get to read that. It's a power terminal for the small elevator used for construction. Will you turn the power on for the elevator? Yeah. So now we can use the elevator. Shortcuts made. Power to the elevator has resumed. Nice. I, I, like, I really like Dino Crisis because the story behind it, you have to solve mystery and like get your ass back to reality mm, I don't know those games are kind of lost to be honest those games are kind of lost in time really there's a terminal which uh, periodically records data for the water temperature the water quality and other useful data I was saying that yesterday like this game I played down a crisis before this uh oh you got the plug. Yeah, that's fine. I didn't want to. These games are kind of like... These games really are kind of like time-specific, really. They don't really make games like this anymore. Um, this is what I was talking about yesterday, because we were streaming... Or two days ago, because we did Dino Crisis 1 as well. And uh, they don't really make games like this anymore. Oh, nice. I don't know how that guy got me, but that's Alright, since he got me, we're gonna rush through this. 
There's no point. If you can't get the no damage bonus, it's not worth wasting your time. Yeah. Don't wanna be. Later. I recommend. How do I say it? Sudoku? Is it Sudoku? Suyukin? Sudoken? Is that what you say? Sudoken? Am I saying it right? Sudoken? I'm probably not, right? So now we got the plug so we can open up the shutters. I don't remember this part. So now the shutters are done. Would you like to operate it? Yeah. Sweet. Maybe zero escape games you might like. I mean, 99 is kind of uh, old, odd, not old, but there are plenty of mysteries in it. But yeah, I agree, Baka. These kind of games aren't specific, aren't specific like that. The whole reality thing. Yeah, machine cooling aqueducts and the shutters are open these days. Yeah, games are really defined by the times they come out in. You know, a lot of people hated this type of game. A lot of people hated this type of game style. That was what, that was like one of the driving forces for them to change RE4. Where so many people were complaining about tank controls. I was, uh, I was on it, I was watching a stream the other day. And it was Cinematos Ken, and he and his buddy were streaming, um, Silent Hill 2. And it was tank controls. And the guy picks the controller up, never played the game, and he was like, Oh man, tank controls? With like a negative... You know, with a negative mindset. A lot of people had a negative mindset to tank controls back in the day. And that that was a uh, that was gameplay defined by its times, you know? Tank controls weren't bad. Just people didn't like them. And that's something that's probably never gonna be a thing ever again. I miss these things. I, I tell the story all the time when I was in co I grew up on RE games. And I was in college, and I got close. My roommate and my girlfriend at the time to all play uh, the original REs, and they couldn't even grasp the concept of walking forward. I was dying laughing. Because obviously I knew what I was doing because I grew up on the games. But it was so funny to watch them, like, they couldn't even, like, take two steps forward. And it just, you know, it's a product of its time. Which I think is really cool, you know? I think it's really cool you go back and see how things change over time. Su E Koden. Oh, Su E Koden. Huh. Oh, that was good. hard to move the stick to make James walk forward. I don't think it's that hard at all. I don't think RE games are hard, but I'm biased. I'm extremely biased. controls are the devil you know when you play the new when you play the remakes with the new controllers it's not the same it's not the same i i, I tried it once and I, I couldn't do it i was like this is awful it makes the it takes some of the hardness of resident evil out and just makes it way too easy oh well get out of here got hit you're just trying to trigger me Tank controls aren't that bad. I thought people just give them a bad rap because people gotta have something to complain about. Well, unless it's something wrong with their controller or they think they can move the controller by other buttons. I don't know. 
Nah, it's probably just a concept that that's just not it's foreign to them. I think that's the beauty of tank controls. Is Some people also didn't like the idea in RE that you weren't able to control the camera, so it's like you're always, you're not able to move the camera, which wasn't really a thing in video games yet. So I didn't get the complaint at the time, but that was a that was one of the complaints was no free roam camera. Some people didn't like the pre uh, pre set angles. But, to be honest, I loved it. I thought it was awesome. I'm not going to say it's great in every aspect, though. Like, sometimes it is frustrating. Dino Burger. Freaking Flintstones Dino Burger. Uh oh. I didn't know I could hold the button down and just continue shoots. I had no idea. Yee haw! Pow! games are for losers. <laughs> As you're playing like old ass like fighting games. Get out of here. Skiver. Get out of here. Alright, let's save our game. I think we got a shop. Cover. I grew up on those games. I know. Me too. Nostalgia is a great boner that wants to be rubbed every now and then. If sometimes more often for some people. These old games get a lot of views too. So, I mean, there's a lot of people out there that like them too, you know. Oh, we got a key. Oh, this is the key. The city, that's the key to Edward City. We got it. The pipe of the oxygen supply has been cut or chewed off from the back of his diving suit. That sucks. He suffocated to death. That sucks. You found a new dino file. I have no idea how to pronounce that. Hell. Hell soy saurus. Pilosaurus. Pilosaurus? P Pilosaurus? Near lizard. Damn, that thing is tall. Hmm. Our lifeline, the third energy reactor, is located in the lake underwater. Half of our mechanics who go under for uh, prevented, preventative maintenance, never come back. They probably become bait for that giant thing. There are carnivores. They are carnivorous reptiles. Carnivorous reptiles, with their long necks, they surface the head. They surface the head to breathe. Wait a minute, isn't that weird? With their long necks, they surface the head to breathe. Wouldn't it be better to be with their long necks they surfaced their head to breathe? Or am I wrong? It's been reported that they have been attack they've been seen attacking the Pteranodons from the water with their long uh, agile necks. When attacked by them, aim for their heads. They try to pull their prey into the water using their long necks. 
when they are attacked, the best thing you can do is fire back at them. When you encounter them in the water, unfortunately, the only thing that will really hurt them is an explosive artillery. You also have to be careful for the strong water current they produce when they swim. It may be wise to avoid the, uh, fighting them in the water. Basically, the game is telling us, whip out that torpedo launcher. Whip it out, girl. Because dinosaurs are for losers. <laughs> are you just in a everything's for losers? How have you been, Skiver? I haven't seen you in a bit, man. How you been? I don't know if this... I don't know if this thing's killable or not. I have no clue. Shop. Magazine. Hell no, I don't want to upgrade that bitch. You're crazy. But we made our money back. I think on normal mode, this thing's only 26,000. Uh, I've been good. I finally got more spare time again, and I saw you were playing Dino Crisis. Yes, yes, yes. Been playing Dino Crisis since, um, Monday. Since Monday. What's well, been keeping you busy? The third energy reactor. Dun dun dun. Uh oh. Look at that walk. Gotta kill it. No. If it bleeds, we can kill it. Yeah, that's fucked up.
This thing sucks. without getting hit is what I want to know. Bro, there was no contact whatsoever. That man did not touch me. None. There is like this big of a gap between us. Huge. How do you get through this without getting touched though? I'm really curious because it seems really hard and you can't shoot him with two rockets at the same time It just I mean like at one after another it doesn't seem like the game will allow you to do that Died of a heart attack. Yeah, I must have because that dude literally did not touch me at all You can't stun him with the shockwave He's too big for the shockwave stun So, I wonder what you can do. I've never been able to do this fight good. It's always been dirty. This fight's always been slow and dirty. Let's grab the key. Let's grab the file. I'm missing the one about the, um, the, the ones that spit acid. I don't know where the file is for those guys. The ones that, the, the little acid spitters. Those guys are annoying. Alright, skip this. Get touch by this dinner come get it oh oh chat oh we're doing it play some rockets up i got him the water current is presently normal Deactivating defense mode. So basically, you just gotta shoot him early. 
That's good to know for the next time if I remember that. Uh, the elevator uh, control pilot. Yes. Would you like to go to the surface? Yes. Check how convenient this is. Check it out. This is amazing. That sucks. We didn't get the bonus for no hits. Yo, we're at Edward City. Check it out. Isn't that awesome? Don't need even don't even need to drive here. Welcome back. How's the water? I don't recommend the diving in this resort. I knew you were alive. Yo, Dylan! I found survivors here! Really? We were about to give up. Where are you? The place is Edward City. Hurry! They're... David! David! Edward City? That's not far from here. Let's go! Let's go! 